This is a short video to demonstrate the MEGA Thinlock demo kit and identify all the parts that come in the kit. So for starters, the star of the show is the MEGA Gen 1 Rev G Thinlock, which is a shape memory alloy wire powered latch release mechanism. Ideal for use as a cabinet latch or a glove box release mechanism. So, uh, pretty highly optimized at this point. The Gen 1 thin lock is uh, less than 5 millimeters in total thickness. And I'll demonstrate that in a minute. But what's included in the kit are two of the thin lock actuators. One that's built up on a little demonstrator we call the, uh, the DART and another one built up in a, more like a cabinet latch release mechanism. I'll demonstrate all of those in a minute. Uh, we're also going to include a little rebuild kit, some shape memory wire and a couple extra screws, and um, a selection of MEGA analog driver, which is uh, data sheets are available on our website, but this is a P-channel MOSFET switching circuit. Operates from 0 to uh, 30 volts, or something like 2 to 30 volts. And um, in addition to these, we've included a couple that are real easy to operate right out of the box with a couple of 9-volt batteries. And um, it's a good point, or a good time to point out that it, uh, we don't really know how long these batteries are going to last. We haven't done a lot of testing, so if you really want real long life out of this, um, go to a lithium polymer battery instead of the 9-volt alkalines that we're including in the kit. So uh, I've got one of those here on Amiga Analog Driver. <clears throat> it is important to pay attention to the polarity of this. So when hooking this up, uh, it's labeled on the PCB that the left pin is V in or voltage in. And just like the red line 9 volt input here, uh, positive is on the left pin of this Amiga Analog Driver. The center pin is an end contact when either this stage hits that end contact or this lever hits the end contact. It cuts power to the MOSFET, uh, sorry, to the shape memory wires. So no matter how long you're holding this button, you cannot damage the SMA wires. And finally, that third pin is a ground pin. And without further ado, that's how the thin lock actuates. So also included in the kit is the DART, operates the exact same way, but we built a little bit of a spring load in there with the spring plunger. And then of course you can use this tool to recock any of these actuators. So finally is the cabinet latch uh, scenario. Uh, this little demo illustrates that um, we've put about 110 pounds on this uh, drawer. We're able to break uh, one of the pins off here, but only at about 110 pounds. So you can put a, quite a lot of load on there without damaging the actuator. The maximum load during operation is probably going to be limited to something less than 10 pounds. So the ideal situation here is no load on that drawer. And just like the other hookup, V into plus, ground to ground. So this is the MEGA. Gen 1 Rev G Thin Lock Actuator Demo Kit.